Hey, it's Heather, and I've got a boxy charm today. So I did get my boxy charm a couple of days ago. Um, I've been really bad about filming for the last week. Um, the week before, I filmed and filmed and filmed and filmed and filmed. And you saw that because I did five videos in a row because I don't want to film something and then it go up three weeks from now. And you know what I'm saying? In case there's something that you're interested in, you might be able to find it if I get it up quicker rather than not. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to lips on. Emily and I just got back from a baby shower. She actually just brought me home. Well, she dropped me off the interstate. My husband came pick me up off the interstate because she had to get to Bible study. But anyway, let's take a look at BoxyCharm. And I do have a card this time. Yay! I'm going to put my glasses on so I can see. And they're dirty. This is the Fenty... Um, I know th this is the Fenty Beauty Box. By BoxyCharm. This is all Fenty Beauty in here. I do have one Fenty Beauty item. It is a concealer of some sort. And I just put it in my new vanity. So I'm going to start using it. It's going to be really nice to be able to sit down. I might I might do a get ready with me there. I have to get used to where everything is now. Everything before it was all in bags. I was digging through a bag. I spent more time trying to find the product I was looking for than I did putting it on. Other than my eyebrows. My eyebrows take me forever too. <clears throat> but let's start with the big Mac Daddy that's in here. This is the Moroccan Spice. I like the name. It's an eyeshadow palette. Moroccan Spice has 16 rich pigmented shades serving up a dash of matte, satin, pearl, metallic, and shimmer finishes. MSRP is $29. The purple box here, it's wrapped very well. Ooh, how pretty is that? That's gorgeous. That is absolutely stunning. I think it's absolutely stunning. I'm not one for the metallics. I'll do shimmer. I think my favorite color in this box right here, let me try to not blind you, is this little pink one right here. Woo, there is a plastic cover. Didn't want to drop it. Um, this is going to go in my giveaway. I do need to go through my palettes and get rid of some stuff, but a lot of these colors are darker than I would be. I mean, the colors are gorgeous. There are colors I'm afraid of. And the ones I'm not afraid of, I've already gotten duplicate. So this is going to go on my giveaway. I know I had said that I was going to do a giveaway at 2,500. That happened a couple of days ago. I, I went past the 2,500 and didn't even realize it till this morning. So thank you. So this will be part of that giveaway. Put that back in the box. Very nice. Next we have, I'm just going to pull out of here and find it. This is the highlighter, the Kilowatt Freestyle Highlighter. Light up where you want, when you want, with this weightless long wear cream powder hybrid, cream powder hybrid highlighter in the iconic shade Trophy Wife. Okay, very pretty. Let's see. I don't think I've ever seen the shade. Wow. Okay, it's really gold. I wonder how that swatches. The iconic shade. I'm gonna have to do before I swatch this and see. I have absolutely nothing like this. All of my highlighters are whites, a very, very light color. This might look decent when I have some color on my face at you know getting a little bit of a tan, which was a beautiful day today. But we got more rain coming tomorrow night. So I'm not going to swatch this right now because um, I'm going to see what it looks like on other people. If I don't think this is something that I will wear, then I will probably add it to my giveaway. So I'm not sure, but it says the MSRP is $36. That one I'm going to have to see how it turns out. I, it's absolutely something I don't have. So that makes me think it might be staying with me. All right, we have Invisimat. Okay, blotting, they're blotting papers. Ultra portable blotting paper that lets you touch in stealth mode with a super chic ref refillable mirrored compact that looks like a lipstick case. Lift away shine while leaving makeup perfectly untouched. How cute is that? And that might be something my daughter enjoys. 
I get sweaty, but I don't really get oily because I'm overly dry. And the retail value on that is $16. I've actually never in my life purchased blotting papers. Fenty Beauty. What is this? I think this is going to be a lipstick. Mademoiselle Plush Matte Lipstick. All moods, all skin tones. A pocket perfect lipstick with a long wearing, petal soft matte finish. Available in a rainbow of weightless color intense shades that each each designed to flatter all skin tones. Included shade may vary. So my color is PMS. That's pretty dark. That is pretty dark. I might be a little dark for me if it actually comes off that way. Again, this is going to be something that I look up on a, on a video and see if when somebody else has tried it on how it, because I have a uh, Clinique, I think it's called Black Cherry. It looks like that in the tube, but when you put it on, it's so sheer, it just does like a berry color on your lip, and I love it. This one, I don't know. If it's a matte, I have a feeling that it's going to be that intense and that dark, and it's probably not something I would wear, but that could go in a giveaway. All right, we have the Gloss Bomb Universal Lip Luminizer. Now, that sounds like my cup of tea. Oh, and that lipstick is, uh, MSRP is $18, sorry. The ultimate gotta have it lip gloss with explosive shine that feels as good as it looks. In shade Diamond Milk, a dewy highlight for your lips. Fenty Beauty Gloss Bomb is the essential finishing touch to your Fenty face. MSRP is $19. Ooh, that's pretty. So it's, I have nothing on my lips right now. So let's just, this will be something I keep. Ha. Huh. Wow. Okay, I'm trying to get my lights back on. Ooh, and it smells good. It smells like summer. And that, it's just, it's got, I can see the shimmer. I can see the glittery or whatever. And I think this would be a fun touch over any of the lipstick. That sucker's going in my purse. That smells divine. What was this called again? Gloss Bomb in Diamond Milk. I'm keeping that one. All right, and then last but not least is the Match Stick. Shimmer Skin Stick, a magnetized makeup stick and a long wear light as air shimmer formula to highlight, blush, and enhance. This long wear cream to powder highlighter stick is weightless, blendable, and lives to be layered. Included shade may vary, and I got Chili Mango. Chili Mango. So now I can't tell if it has a smell because all I can smell is my lips. I'm curious. So this is a, like a, a highlight, blush, and enhance. I think this would be fun for summer. Let's just try it. Well, it definitely comes off as orange on my skin. Let's see if we blend it in. I don't know. That might be fun in the summertime. I feel like it might be a little too orange for me, but it's something I could definitely play with. And now that I've touched it, I don't really want to give it as a giveaway. So that was a fun box. That was a fun box. So the eyeshadow palette for sure will be in my 20. There's a few other things that I've been collecting that's going to go in my giveaway. Um, I Because I wasn't expecting to hit 2,500 quite yet, and I've been kind of out of the loop for the last week, try, I've been trying to reply to um, comments and stuff, which I have a note on that in a second. Um, I, I've been... Uh, I've been busy outside of YouTube for a minute, you know, for this past week. So um, I, there, I will figure out the details of them this week. In fact, I'll work on that tomorrow. I do have to work tomorrow morning and I do have to pick my granddaughter up from school to after, up tomorrow afternoon, but there is a sliver of time in there that I can kind of get my wits about me and try to figure out what I want to do. Um, I, I'll put it in probably the next video that I upload. We'll have the details, you know, the comments below or whatever. I do need you guys to make it easier for me to get in contact with you um, to, you know, once I announce the winner, I have struggled in the past trying to get in contact with the winners so that I could get your address and ship, you know, your, your box to you. So I need to figure out the best way. And if, if you'll comment in this video, 
I mean, I'm still new at this. I'm a tiny channel. I'm still learning how to do this. I've done two giveaways and they both ended up being a difficult to, to reach the winner and, and uh, get things shipped out. So if you have a suggestion, once I've given out the name, how, how I go about getting, please let me know. As I'm sure you guys have entered other giveaways with other channels. I need some guidance here. I'm telling you, I need some guidance. I hope you guys have a very happy day. Be on the lookout for my video that has the I, the details of um, my giveaway for 2500 Thank you guys so much for helping me get there. And love you guys. I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.